Hey there. Let's continue where we left off, man. Oh, oh, oh is that you, Hunter? Oh, well, welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, whatever. I don't care. So that was the little one. Is she eating three square meals a day without miss without fussing? Is she in your hair? Is she pulling her own load? Is she... Huh? What's that? You want to build a what? An, an airship. <laughs> an airship so you can fly. <laughs> Brilliant. You know what? You're on. I know by now that if I don't help you fly, you'll take off anyway and leave me in the dust. Alright. All we need is some serious heat and a mountain of coal. Well, lucky for you, all these caves were created due to volcanic activity. Did you know that? No, I wouldn't have known. Volcanic activity makes it easier for us to get our hands on heaps of coal. One problem, and yes, it rhymes with... Fonsters? The cavern are crawling with monsters that are highly resistant to heat. Mining is a more hazardous occupation than ever. Whenever the diggers try to get some coal, they keep running into a Gravios. The big lug -a jug Hunter, if you can drive that Gravios away, we can go hunt coal for the airship. It'll be done faster than you can say Troverian... Trickle? Treacle? Treacle. Good luck in there. Alright, let's take care of a Gravios. Hi, Doodle. The boss told me what's up. In fact, I jotted down the name of the operation. Let's see. Uh, here it is. Operation Kidred Hunter is gonna mine us some coal so we can make our own airship, but I don't get ate by Gravios. Yep, I'm really gl glad I wrote that down. Looks like you'll be heading for the volcanic hollow. Exciting. I mean, who doesn't like vol active volcanic regions that bake you alive and spew magma all over the place? Anyway, remember to pack some cold drinks to stave off the heat and prevent your health from draining. Keep an eye out for large, magma-loving monsters on the prowl. Oh, and while you're at it, Doodle, I'd also like to ask a tiny favor. Very tiny. Microscopic, really. It can wait until you get back, but... You, could you reenact the, how the Gravio shoots its thermic rays? For science? If you could do the roar, too, that would be a hundred times better. I'll have my notebook ready to scribble it all down. Are those daggers I see in your eyes? What's the matter this time? Oh no, I did it again. You want credit. Don't worry, I'll put your name below the sketch. Better. Of course it is. Now go stabios that gravios. God damn it. Damn. Gravios needs to get stabiosed. I'm fine. I'm, I'm fine. Don't worry about me. We're just gonna pretend that it didn't happen and go on from there. Oh, I wonder if this version of the map will have the same weird graphical effect bug issue thing. Curious. I'll see. Ah, Doodle, I almost forgot. First time in the Volcanic Hollow, right? I guess congratulations are in order. The heat here can really get to you. Even even a cool hunter like you will lose hell fast in this environment. But luckily for you, the Wycoon gave us some cold drinks, free of charge. I left them in the supply box, so help yourself. You like Fulger Bug flavor, right? Fulger Bug flavor? How would that have anything to do with cooling me down? We splat. Oh, it looks like it. Nope, it does it. Yeah, that's what that is right there. Oh no, it's not. That's the water over there. Huh. So there is some amount of weird texture going on. You can tell that from how it's like moving. But that's interesting. Hey, shut up. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Oh, it's hot. Um, 
Gravios has to be an either 8 or 9. Likely 9. Or 8. That's fine. Ah, oh, damn. Fucking ankle. bitch. Oh, bitch. That was fucking rude. Okay. Hoping the weapon sharpness wouldn't break that early. It's fine though. Shut up. Pack's broken. Good. Good hits overall. There we go.
Nice. We're just gonna do it. Sleep gas. Sharpen while I can. I'm gonna eat this hit or not because he's a dingus, you know. Roll away. He's gonna charge and then I'm gonna do this. Uh, no, I don't want to do that actually because if I knock him down there, it's just gonna throw me off. Nice. This should break the stomach. Normally the way it works is two, and the second one breaks it. It's the same with back breaks too. It happens with like Rathian and Lowe's. Oh man, I ran out of my buffs. That's why it didn't go that long. Oh shit. I'll, I'll eat this. I'll eat that. I needed to heal. I was too low. Heal here. Grab that shiny. I need to stop going for these half the time because most of the time they're just wearing gears. Carves because it's Gravio's tail. Hell yeah. Nice. What sucks is it's it's Gravio's, so he's got a ton of health. Um don't know. I'm gonna go ahead and sharpen, just in case, because I don't remember when the last time it was that I did. So I should be pretty close to it going down. So we're sharpen, we're good to go, we're gonna run down here and beat his ass. He's moving around still, I can tell. That is not what I pressed. Go ahead and take a mega potion. Don't risk it, just go ahead. 
death. Dude, Gravios is fucked up hitboxes. No. Yep, saw that one coming too. Steel. This one's been going for a while now. At least it's not like a 30 minute hunt like it is in the first dose or whatever. Older games. Because god damn. I desp- Oh, fuck off. I despised hunting Gravios in older games because of its fucking bloated ass health pool. But, I mean, it makes sense that it is. It's just a big, beefy monster. It's just annoying. <laughs> okay. I'm surprised that worked. Nice, actually. Unfortunate. It's weak enough to be captured, I just... I'm trying, man. Okay. This is the most I've ever had to heal myself in any hunt. My paintball wore off. Let me sharpen, then I'll paintball it. on the off chance that it does run away, which it's doing right now. Nearly 15 minutes, I think. Let's get that last car started, and I'll tell you. Yeah, actually, almost 15 minutes. 14:05. Oh, I had another car. four cars off Gravios. Damn. Okay.
Oh, man. Lovely. Well, we got some Monster Bowling Pluses, which is what we needed for some stuff, I think. Sorry, I got my controller like right next to the mic. I'm just trying to click through that stuff real quick so I can readjust real quick in, the ch in my chair. Nice. Holy smokes, we did it. We actually did it. The caravan is now the proud owner of a real airship. They are lug airworthy. Can you believe it? We can go anywhere now. Across the sea, above the clouds. I tell you, kindred hunter, it's been wo wonder after wonder traveling with you. My life feels like it's on wheels again. We've got much to celebrate. Your Gravios hunt, our new airship. Let's party down, rest up, and then ship out far. Just talk to the chief when you're set to go. I hope we're getting close to solving some of this here article's mysteries. Nothing would make me happier, I tell ya. Uh, let's go ahead and save real quick before I do that, because I also need to restock too. Deposit a bunch of stuff as well. Nice. Alright, let's go talk to this old coot. Uh, talk to you two. What do you have to say? Err, about that airship. Who wouldn't love one of those? By the way, have you ever considered going on a harvest tour? Okay, harvest tour quest. I'll, I'll gladly take it. Thank you. It... It's stunning. I should have known my little girl's blueprints would... would... Go ahead, Caravaneer. Give this beauty a name. She's ready to weather the stormiest of skies. I guarantee it. I can't believe it's really happening. My little girl is about to fly off to the home of the Wyvarians. She's always dreamed of this. Are you ready to head to your next destination? Want to fly to Cathar? Yes, I do. Right. All aboard the airship, then.
Whoa, cool! Your will is humongous! Oh, sorry. Just wiped that off. Gross. So you are you a hunter? Are ya? Are ya? That is so cool. I see you that and that guy in the hat arrive in your big awesome whale. Huh? The guy in the hat? Oh, he's over there. Like way over there. I think he's talking to the elder near the gate to the shrine. He was showing off some kind of big sparkly thing he took out of his hat. Oh, sorry again. Gross. Hunter, a moment if you will. Have you any interest in multiplying your items at a new market? The one I have in mind is called Dundorma Market. They satisfy a hunter's core needs with a wide supply of useful tools. If you can furnish a few things, I will be able to secure a deal with this market so I can multiply items there. Check the villager requests if you want to know all of the details. I'm counting on you. I was gonna say, can I even turn any of these in? Who wants three pill? Okay, that's not hard. I know where to get them. I think I have enough stamina nectar. Um. I'm trying to remember. I just, I just don't. Um. Cause you need a shit ton of the power. Hmm. Oh, you're that hunter who arrived on the whale. Hello there. It must have been such a long journey to Cathar. I can't remember the last time we had a visitor. I certainly admire your vessel. <laughs> Did you build it yourselves? I must say, I never thought I'd see a whale coming, come flying across the sky. Hiya, hiya. Nice to meet you. I saw you arrive on the whale. I'm Cathar's melding pot master. Fourteenth in a long line of melders, in factual fact. But folks around here just call me Maxima. Melding is some powerful juju. I, I'm not reading that. <laughs> Invented it. Uh, tell me, do you know about frenzy crystals? They're a type of item. Melders like me can use them to multiply certain items and reform talismans. Have you got any extra talismans sitting around, round? Then that's a good time to try the melding juju. Bring me three talismans you don't need and require, and the required frenzy crystals. Then I'll toss them into this here juju pot and give them a little swish swish. Once the melding is done, out pops a brand new talisman. It takes a little time for the juju to jujuify, jujify though. So you'll have to wait till you get back from a hunt. For more information, yeah, check the help screen. Uh, we're gonna meld talisman because I know I have some. I don't know what precision is, I'm gonna get rid of it. Hmm, what have we here? Travelators? How the heck did you get up here? Salutations, old one. Is this Cathar? It sure is. Village of the Crying Wind. Cathar is con constant. Constant. Why can I not say that? <clears throat> Constantil. Constantily buffeted. Is that a typo? I don't know. Buffeted by a celestial gale. And if you listen, see, you can hear it. That's the sound of the wind blowing ability right back where it came from. <laughs> Take that, ability. We haven't got much here but Wyvarians, but make yourselves at home if you like. Thanks, old one. We'll take you up on that kind off. Well, I hate to jump right into the hard questions, but have you ever laid eyes on this article before? We came all the way to Cathar to figure out what... Ah! Hey! Gods and monsters! Is that a... 
Don't tell me it's a... Where'd you get that, youngin? Speak up. Ah, so you know what it is. Stupendous. Let's just say it fell into my hands. Now finish your dang sentences and tell me what it is, please. Hmm. It's a bad omen, is what it is. It spells nothing but trouble for me and the other villagers. Way back before time was time, there was a terrible calamity at Heaven's Mount. Monsters lost their minds. They went berserk. They went berserkers and started tearing everything inside apart. Nobody knows why. Soon Heaven's Mount was no better than a field of corpses and carcasses. The history books have you believing? Describified the whole affair as the winds of evility consuming the mountain. The mount. I say it's all one big fairy tale, but people have their superstitions. That article of, your, of yours comes from the site of the calamity where the winds of ability struck. Ever since, the place has been known as the Sanctuary. Nobody's allowed inside no more. The Sanctuary? Yep. The land protected by the sigil. Anyway, let's get one thing clear. You keep that article thing under your hat, you hear? <laughs> hmm, that's right. Something tells me we haven't squeezed all the secrets out of him just yet, Kendra Hunter. Let's do the rounds and see what other info turns up. Doodle, I know it took a while, but I have a quest for you that's different from anything else you've done before. Done. Whatever. Huh. What's on your mind? You look stressed out. Oh, the boss's article? It's an ill omen. You don't say. Well, maybe my quest will take your mind off it. Can I give it to you? Can I? Can I? Good. It's called Advanced Odd Ape Out. Hmm. This one looks like it's a tough one. You need to hunt a Congalala, but the guild sent along some unnerving fine print. This Congalala does not exhibit normal behavior. Use extreme caution. Well, that sounds... Interesting. You'll be hunting at Heaven's Mount. Have you been yet? As the name suggests, the mountain's peak juts above the clouds, so it almost looks like it's floating in midair. Of course, there's a trade off for all that scenic beauty. You have to watch for falling rock, rubble, and tricky terrain. And let's not even get into the weird ruins from who knows when or all the vicious monsters. Yikes. And by yikes, I mean yay. Aren't you excited to check it out, Doodle? What better reason to visit Heaven's Mount than to hunt a Kongalala? Alright, Cathar's quest gate is next to the open air kitchen. If you're wondering, don't get lost. Outbreak. Yeah, it's not good. It's not good at all. Uh, we will go for this. Ow. This thing's gonna hurt, by the way. I do want to make sure that I am full up. Because I need four from here, I think. Oh man, this map is so good. I really like this map. I'm gonna go this way. Yeah, I figured. I'm just gonna paintball it for right now because I do want to mine. Uh, maybe I'll fight it a little bit, but I want to mine. That's the thing.
Yeah, this Congolala is not nice. What the? Doodle, is it just me or does something seem very wrong with that Congolala? The black mist is spewing out. It's just like that Gormagala. But why would a Congolala? This makes no sense. I don't like this one bit, Doodle. Not one bit. Please be extra careful. Whoops. Bounce, bounce. No. Oh, that hit me? Really? Wow. Okay. Well, we're going to get rid of that. Why the fuck are you up there? Yeah, it's kind of a small one. Yeah, I actually don't know where to get the... <sighs> okay. I don't know where to get the orange buff off of Konga. He's just spamming that shit, man. Fucking pissing me off. That was him leaving. Okay. I'm a mine a little bit. That's, uh, dude, I fucking hate Kongalala. Like, he's not a hard fight, he's just fucking annoying. I need Gossamite, and I'm pretty sure this is where I get it from. I don't think it's high rank. I hope it's not high rank, man. If it's high rank, that shit sucks. Good god, dude, I've taken so much damage from that poison. It lasts for fucking ever. Knock away. Armor Sphere Plus. Broken Pickaxe. Macalite. <laughs> this missing toe I would assume that's an account item I'm 
We... Ah, fuck. Nice. I don't remember how many I needed, but I needed quite a few. Fucking Remobra. Wow, that's such a small window to get that. Nice, got a mount. I would like to card these room over, but that's not happening. Tremor. gonna be that guy that's gonna spam it, huh? You know, you, you go ahead and do that. I'm gonna carve that. Now I'll come over there and beat your ass. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Yep, there it was. <laughs> I fucking hate it, dude. I hate... I hate high rank conga, and it's just fucking spamming its breath. It's so annoying, dude. Sharpen. I wouldn't be able to get around anyways to get the orange buff, so. You limping? Nope, not limping yet. Ah, right there. Again, I mean, I'm, I'm mining. I'm trying to get a Gossamite Ore. Because I think I need two for this weapon upgrade. Or four. But I mean, I can't upgrade it yet because I also don't have the, uh, I don't have the Nursilla Spikes or whatever it is, Claw of Spikes, one of the two. I need like two of those. Damn, is that really all the mining spots I had? Holy. I mean, there might be some in eight, but I'm not, I'm not going that far out of my way. I'll probably get a Harvest Tour after this anyways, so... 
It's fine. I probably need to repaint ball it too. just real quick just because there's probably a couple mining spots in here maybe at least one at least one right none damn dude brutal uh there's probably one in seven maybe 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 it's still alive obviously Time. Oh no. I'm gonna heal just in case. stamp? No, but a first aid med. We'll take that, I guess. Lots of bugs in here. Piles. We got a a mining spot. It looks like maybe I can get another gossamite ore to come back. One though, that sucks, dude. Like I said, I think I need like four. Damn, even that hunt took a while. But I mean, this is the this is to introduce you to the apex monsters. Yeah, not a single one, just iron ore. Holy. Damn it. Crouch. There we go. Thank you. Oh, these might just be account items. Aside from the unknown skull. It's fine. Throw it away. Nice. Man, oh nice, an adamant seed. <laughs> Speed gather. I mean, it's not terrible. It's not terrible. New monsters. Woo!
Why, hello there. How goes the hunting on Heaven's Mount? It's a wondrous place, isn't it? But also treacherous. The footing can be poor and the terrain tough to navigate. And of course, it's teeming with dangerous monsters. You'd be finished if you got lost out there. Listen, is there anything I can do to help? I would hate to see you come to any harm. Ah, got it. Why don't you go on a harvest tour and acclimate yourself to the area? That way you'll be able to move about more confidently when you face monsters. I filed a quest with the guild marm. Harvest store Heaven's Mount. Nice. Uh, la, 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 la. Let's talk to you real quick because I want to see what I got. Nice trash, dude. <laughs> I mean, it has a slot, though. There's that. And it's better than the other shit I had that did nothing for me because it was all gunner stuff. Ah, Hunter. Why the long face? What's that about the Heaven's Mount? The Kongalala went for dessert? What? The Kongalala went berserk? Gods and monsters, this is terrifable. That sounds like a calamity all over again. Darn, blast it. I'll just bite the bullet and report this to the Grand Guru. There's no other way. Huh? You won't ask where he is? I'm glad you asked. The Grand Guru is a hallowed, hallowed figure who's been protecting the mountain for ages. Naturally, he has a special home. That home is right on the other side of this door in the shrine. Generations of Grand Gurus have res residified there. They are not permitted to leave. Ah, I just got an idea. What we need is accurateable information. Let's see. Hunter, I hate to put you through the trouble, but could you head for the Heaven's Mountain and check on the monsters? If any of them are acting funny, like Berserker's funny, then report back to me on the triple. Got it? I mean, we're ending the episode here, but... I like to get the talking out of the way. Doodle, the boss has been acting very strange lately. I think he wants answers about the frenzied monsters and it's and is frustrated that he can't just go find them. Don't be surprised if, he's up, if he ups and vanishes all of a sudden like some bird you scared away. That's just how he is. But enough about him. What's this look of determination on your face? Oh, the Elder wants you to go to the Heaven's Mountain investigate? <laughs> I'm so way ahead of you, Doodle. Check out all these nice, shiny new quests I've written up. Number one, a Zenogar. Number two, a Celtus Queen. And lastly, a Rathalos. A Peerless Hunter, a Weighty Empress, and a King of the Skies. Wow. Any one of them would be a challenge. Do I know how to pick them or what? What? Don't be silly. Why would I pick only the monsters I want to sketch? Uh, how selfish do you think I am? <laughs> Alrighty. A lot of new monsters. I might try and get all three of those done in one in one video, but we'll see. Regardless, hopefully you enjoyed. I'll see y'all in the next one. Laters.